Hi, Matt Battietta with the Battietta Real Estate Group. What is the typical timeline for a short sale? In other words, how long will a short sale take and what is the process? Uh, in our office, the process is as follows. When we take a short sale listing, once we get all the paperwork back from the seller, which consists of a letter of authorization and a listing agreement, a standard listing agreement that's been modified for a short sale, uh, we schedule a time to go out and take pictures of the property, um, do an appraisal so we know where to price it. There's no charge for the appraisal, by the way. The appraisal is the same thing that the bank is going to do when they go to decide what they're willing to sell the property for in the short sale. We just do it ahead of time so we know where to price it. The property goes on the market uh, like a regular home for sale. It doesn't go on the market as a pre-foreclosure or anything like that. It's just a regular home for sale. We have to sell it to a regular buyer. The only difference being obviously that the bank has to approve it because they're taking a loss. Typically, we only need to put the property on the market for about 30 days uh, because within that time frame, we are typically able to generate uh, at least one offer and in many cases, multiple offers. The reason for that is we do a lot of marketing and a lot of advertising. And again, we are typically able to generate multiple offers within about 30 days. The nice thing about that for the seller is it does dramatically minimize the inconvenience to them as far as having the property on the market. Um, once we have offers, we will take the property off the market. Uh, we pick the best offer. We submit that to the lenders with the seller's short sale package, which consists of two months of bank statements, two years of tax returns typically, and a hardship letter. And we will give you examples of a hardship letter so you know what to write. Um, once that paperwork is submitted to the bank, typically if there are two lenders, you're looking at on average about 60 to 90 days of us negotiating with the lenders for a short sale approval. Once we have those approvals, we do a 45 day escrow. So if you figure in say 30 days to maybe 45 of being on the market, 60 to 90 days of negotiating back and forth with the lenders, and then a 45 day escrow, you get up to you know four to six months relatively quickly. Uh, it can take longer. Again, if a buyer um, cancels, which does happen on occasion, we have to drop in another buyer. Um, it doesn't usually cost us that much time because we usually have backup offers, but it can cost another month or maybe two months. And that's why short sales can sometimes take longer than six months. Um, but all in all, it's a very doable process. If you have only one lender, in other words, one loan, that 60 to, 8 to 90 day period will be reduced down to probably about 45 to maybe 60 days. So on average, a short sale takes four to six months from start to finish.